Hello viewers, this is Sifar Rasik. Today my discussion topic is synchronization of radar heading with your gyro compass because this one the inspector check. Uh, viewers, every watch when you come on bridge you can check and if required you can do the synchronization and this is very simple you can do it. Guys, I am showing you one by one step by step you just uh, watch it. You see here one option is main just press the main you can find here nav equipment setting press after that you find a gyro setting you see on the gyro setting you press the course if you press the course here you see here you can import your course as required now i am going to my x band and showing you step by step uh, you see this is my x band radar and here the option is called main you see here main so press main after the navigational equipment setting after that press on the gyro setting course you see here you can input the course so before input the course i will check uh, what is my gyro heading now uh, viewers now gyro heading is 256.1 so this same heading i will input on my radar you see here also 256 point one i'll input this one and after that press enter you see viewers the heading changed to 256.1 uh, viewers now i'll go to my s band radar and here also i'll input my same heading because of my heading is not changing so 2561 and after that i'll press enter uh, viewers you see the heading changed to 256.1 and now is 256.3 because of the gyro heading is changing uh, viewers you see in my x band radar also 256.3 heading and if you go and check the master gyro also same heading 256.3 now guys we check the heading again now you see my heading is 256.5 and for the x band 25615 and for the S band 25615 means this is synchronized accurately. Viewers, you have to ensure that this is synchronized and because of the inspector SIR class, PSC or class, they check this one and you can make it 100% accurate.